What is up everyone? It's Stealth. We're back with another video today. Hope you guys are doing great and living life to the fullest. And as many of you guys probably know, every year during Minecon, we're allowed to vote for a biome to be updated. And last year, it was the taiga, the savanna, and the desert. And of course, the taiga won. So I figured, why not focus on brand new biome ideas directly from feedback? And of course, all of these ideas are currently under review, meaning someone directly from Mojang and Microsoft Studios that actually works on the game has put this idea under review, and there's a good chance we could see it come to Minecraft in a future update. So we're going to be checking out some of these original biome ideas directly from the community, directly from you guys in today's video. It's going to be a lot of fun, so hopefully you do enjoy today's video. I just want to say thank you to everybody who's been supporting my channel lately. Let's see if we can get over 900 likes in today's video. That's just a crazy amount, but I think we can crush it. Don't forget to hashtag Stealth Army as well, because I will be liking and favoriting some of the best comments in today's video. Now let's go ahead and kick it off with the first idea coming in with over 398 votes called Magic Forest. This biome will have gigantic trees, flowers, mushroom houses, and a new mob called fairies. In this biome, you'll have secret chests with items like diamonds, emeralds, new items like rubies, sapphire, and crystals. This is really awesome. I actually wish there was more detail and it was a little bit longer, but you can sort of get an idea for what this biome's gonna have. I wish they would explain the fairies a little bit more. Is that where the magic comes from? The fairies are going to wield magic. Are they going to be good or bad? I mean, I just want to know more about the fairies as well as the magic, as well as just these type of items we can expect to find in this biome. But I do love the whole concept of having everything but larger. Larger trees, larger flowers, larger grass. And who knows, maybe the mushroom houses will have villagers inside and you can trade with them. And maybe the items that you get in this biome as well will have some sort of magic property to them. I don't know, but I do love the whole concept of a magic forest. Let me know how you guys feel down below about this biome and would you like to see it in Minecraft in a future update. Now let's go ahead and move on to the next idea with 329 votes called the Cherry Blossom Grove. Cherry blossom trees would make an amazing addition to the game and would add some fancy to many people's worlds. Like with oak trees and how you can harvest apples, you would also be able to harvest cherries from these trees. I really hope you take my idea into your consideration. So I really like the whole idea of introducing a new tree into the game because if you introduce a new wood in the game, you get new slabs, new stairs, new fences, possibly new items as well. So there's a lot of benefits to introducing new trees into the game and especially one that produces food like cherries. But we also got to consider that we received a new food in the village and pillage update through the taiga biome, which is the sweet berry bushes, which might have a lot of similarities to berries in general. So this might be a little bit too soon or they might just overlap. So maybe the cherry tree is not the best tree to introduce at this point in time. There's thousands of trees out there that they could focus on, and I was really hoping that they would describe what this biome is all about, because they really just spent a paragraph focusing on the tree itself and not really describing what this whole biome will have besides the tree, so I was really hoping for more of a description about the biome itself, maybe talk about not only the plant life, but the mobs and animals that we can find in this biome, as well as possibly new types of villagers. Now, the good news is that this is under review, so if they wanted to include more details, they still have plenty of time to do that. But let's go ahead and focus on the next idea, which is possibly my favorite idea so far in today's video with 359 votes called Skylands. The Skylands would be like the nether, but instead in the sky. It'd be similar to the concept that was going to be released when Minecraft was in its early stages called Sky Dimension, but a bit different. You'd be able to mine for new ore and create new blocks out of those ore. And using those blocks, you'd be able to build a portal similar to the nether portal and light it with a special flint and steel made out of those new ores. And when you walk into the portal, you're teleported to a heaven-like dimension with crazy new mobs, new blocks, new items, and possibly even a new boss. You could also make special items to decorate your house. The difference being that you can sleep in this heaven dimension, whereas the nether in the end, you cannot sleep. 
This would also allow for people to build their own base in this dimension if they would choose to live there. Another thing is if you fall from this dimension, you can't die. Instead, you're just teleported back to the overworld. Now, I do want to mention that this has a ton of spelling errors, so I did summarize most of this, but I love the whole concept of a sky island, a sky dimension, like new biomes that are in the sky. I wish they would talk a little bit more about the animals, the creatures that we could find in this dimension, possibly even dragons, but we already know that there's a couple ideas that are under review that currently include dragons. So if you guys didn't catch that video, I'll have a link in the description. I'll also have a playlist to all of my other feedback videos where I discuss other biome and dimension ideas that are also under review, like the Oasis, Seasons for Most Biomes, volcano biome the giants biome i talk about all of these things so just check those videos out if you guys are interested in new ideas that are under review thank you so much for watching notification squad y'all are the best and i'll catch you guys all in the next video so take care everyone peace